well. That, see that orange jewelry right there? That may not remember. I can't remember if it's maybe the second or third year. Maybe even the first. Well, no, it had to be the second. Second or third year that we lived here. Becky came in for Mother's Day and she was supposed to buy a flower for the girls to give me for Mother's Day. And there it is. They'll still have it. That's that orange lily. Which dad just about killed because he took the, when he rebuilt this pond, he spread the rock right against that lily. I thought, and they, this is the first year of the bloom. Two years. So he thought he'd choking everything out, but they came back. And of course, here's my beautiful, I have to have this scavola. It can get to cover this whole pot group down, up, down, around. It's so pretty. See his fan shaped leaf? It's so pretty. I put some more yellow zinnias with it. And there's my yellow lily. Of course, I've already taken a picture of that. that I bought you know, probably about 10 years ago. And I hear around the pond, oh well, the sea, seashell down here, I put, I guess I bought all of the genius put in here around the pond. No, that's right, I've got one, one container of that red is actually the double impatient. And can you see, I've got my flying saucer hummingbird feeder. The hummingbird's already been out here, but for some reason, I don't see them for about a month, occasionally. I see them occasionally. I've already seen him out here oh, maybe once or twice a day, but by August, he'll be here a hundred times a day. I don't know what he's busy doing, but he, he, he takes his time coming here. I like to add water to that fountain. What do they think? The way we've got it, Dad's got it, too much water spilling out. He's got a sponge there to help hold the water back, but it throws water out. So every day, just about, I have to add water to that little shell there. 